Hello, you are welcome. Here we want to solve this problem and we find a plus b. Let's label this as equation 1 and this as equation 2. So from equation 1, we have a square minus b square equals to 4. And from here, let's take the square on both sides. We square this side and also we square this side. And then from here, when we expand, this will become a square square, that's a raised to power 4 plus b square square as well, that's b raised to power 4. Then minus 2 times a square times b square, that's minus 2a square b square equals to 4 square there is 16. And uh, in the next step, let's take minus 2a square b square to this side, and this becomes a raised to power 4 plus b raised to power 4 equals to 16 plus 2a square b square and we can write it as 2 into bracket a b or square from the law of indices and uh, in the next step we can substitute the value of a b from equation 2 we have a b to be equal to 2 from here so we put it here then we have a raised to power 4 plus b raised to power 4 will be equal to 16 plus 2 times 2 squared. And uh, from here, this can be written again as a raised to power 4 plus b raised to power 4 equals to 16 plus 2 times 4. Because 2 squared is 4, that's 8. Then we have 16 plus 8. We can add that and this will be a raised to power 4 plus b raised to power 4 equals to 24. Now let's call this equation 3 from here. And in the next step, from the identity we have, let's expand this a square plus b square. So when we expand this, this gives us a raised to power 4 plus b raised to power 4 plus 2a square b square and uh, in the next step we can equally write it again and say this is a raised to power 4 plus b raised to power 4 plus 2 into bracket a b square and from here we have a raised to power 4 plus b raised to power 4 to be equal to 24 from equation 3 so this will be 24 plus 2 a b is 2 that's 2 squared so 2 squared is 4 4 times 2 that's 8 we had that to 24 and that gives us 32 so we say this is 24 plus 8 from here and this will be equal to 32 so now we have a square plus b square or square a square plus b square or square to be equal to 32 and in the next step we can take the square root on both sides so the square root on this side also square root on this side square cancel square root here and this remain a square plus b square equals to plus or minus on this side 32 can be written as 16 times 2 and the 16 square root of 16 is 4 so we can say we have a square plus b squared if be equals to plus or minus 4 root 2 now in the next step from this identity we have a plus b all squared when we expand this this gives us a square plus b square plus 2ab and already we have the value of a square plus b square. So when we put that here, we have plus or minus 4 root 2 here. Then plus 2 times a b. And a b is 2. That's 2 times 2. So we have 2 times 2. That's 4. Then we can add it with this. And this becomes 4 plus or minus 4 root 2. So we have a plus b all square. 
equals to 4 plus or minus 4 root 2. Then from here, a plus b all square will not be a negative, it will be a positive result. So therefore, this minus here will not you know, work on this side because when we subtract 4 minus 4 root 2, of course, it will give us a negative answer. Therefore, from here, we use a plus b squared to be equal to 4 plus 4 root 2. And uh, to remove the square root, I mean this square here, we find the square root on both sides. Square root on this side. Square, we cancel square root here. And we have a plus b to be equal to plus or minus root here, let's factor 4. We have 4 into bracket 1 plus root 2. And from here, square root of 4, we can take that out as 2. And we have a plus b will be equal to plus or minus 2 root 1 plus root 2. So therefore, the value of a plus b we are looking for will be a plus b equals to minus 2 root 1 plus root 2 or we have a plus b to be equals to 2 root 1 plus root 2 so these are the values of a plus b from this problem thank you for watching please subscribe to this channel don't miss out also, share this video and give a thumbs up. See you in the next class and bye for now.